Uh, thank you, uh, Mr. President. I wish to raise a matter uh, this evening for the attention of the Premier. Uh, now, um, Victorians this year have had it uh, pretty tough. It's been, uh, been very, very, very difficult for, um, for I, I think, the overwhelming majority uh, of Victorians. And uh, of recent times, we have seen um, a partial uh, opening up of, of our state. We've seen uh, uh, retail. We've seen um, uh, some sporting, uh, some sport. Well, the retail was smashed. It was indeed. But as we've seen the surviving retail sector starting to uh, to reopen. Uh, we have seen uh, some of the, uh, uh, the the sporting clubs, uh, some of the um, gymnasiums um, open up. Uh, we have seen uh, uh, some of the some of the um, uh, hotels, uh, uh, some of the hospitality uh, uh, areas uh, start to open up as well. But there is one there is one area um, in our society, one sector of our society, that has not had the benefit. Um, of the sort of um, relaxation of restrictions uh, that so many others have. Uh, last week, um, I met with a, a delegation um, of uh, Christian pastors and ministers uh, from the, the western suburbs of Melbourne, and they expressed their very deep concern to me uh, that uh, they were being discriminated against uh, for whatever reason, uh, they were not getting uh, a fair go because they were, you know, they, they were not allowed to uh, to meet uh, in in congregations. Uh, the, the, the churches were were not allowed to uh, resume, um, uh, even if socially distanced and uh, uh, and under control in, in that regard. They are not allowed to, uh, to to expand as as many other sectors in the community have done that. And of course, it's not a, not just a question of um, of discrimination against churches. It's, it's a a discrimination against those using uh, synagogues, using temples, uh, and of course using uh, using mosques. Uh, it's uh, it's something that does cause me uh, very great concern. Uh, any any thought that uh, government should be discriminating or would be discriminating uh, against uh, any religion uh, is is one thing, but for a government to be discriminating against all religion uh, is is pretty outrageous. Uh, some might say that's even-handed, but I think it's pretty, uh, it's pretty disgraceful, actually. Uh, so what I'm asking the Premier to do um, is to allow um, religious freedom again uh, in Victoria. What I'm asking the Premier to do is to allow uh, folk in, in churches or to gather in churches, uh, in synagogues, in temples, in mosques, um, keeping the rules of, of the, the Chief Health Officer, but at the same time able to, um, uh, uh, to worship, uh, able to continue their religious practices uh, so that this uh, uh, apparent discrimination will end as soon as possible.